What's up, everybody? Welcome to Crossfire, the conversational review show presented by Fornex Level Gamers. I am Cutter28, and joining alongside me, as always, Black Knight6222. Now, today we're heading back into The Walking Dead, Season 2, Episode 1 by Telltale Games. Back into The Walking Dead. Season 2 started. I'm getting a feel of Clem is now grown up. With well, the end of the season one, we were a naive, younger Clementine. And right. now that we're into season two, the first five minutes have pulled us in, drawn things up, and then we're, we've grown up. Clem is now mature. She's she able has to. Her weapon. Absolutely. She has her guns now. Like she's, she, even the way her demeanor is with, towards other people. Right. We're starting to get a sense of Clementine is her own woman. She no longer has anybody to kind of guide her, in a sense. Right. It's, this is me, and this is what you get. Yeah. How do you, how do you like that transition from what we've been used to to a now a more of a stable person? Yeah, and it, it's a must. I mean, if she's going to survive out there, oh, man. she needs to grow up, she needs to mature, and she needs to look after herself. Yeah, I like that change. I like that characteristic now of this is me, and, yeah, I'm not taking any crap from anybody. Exactly. Right? Yep. Yeah. I'm liking the story. The story's, again, pulled me in. It's keeping me going within within the game. I'm looking forward to episode two, and I'm looking forward to episode three, and I just can't wait to keep going. I can't give it up enough to Telltale Games. I love what they're doing here. Right, right. Myself, I feel it's more of a storyline, more so than the interactive playing. Yeah, you're sitting back. I'm, for, for me, though, it doesn't bother me at all. I right. like that I'm just sitting there. I'm chilling out, and I'm just watching the dialogue come up, and I get to pick my choices, and I'm not always sitting there with a rifle and I'm mowing down on people or having big explosions all the time. I, I just, I'm just looking for that time for myself to chill out. That's true. And That's play true. a bit of game. When you play this game, play it when you're in that mood. You yeah, know. it's a slower pace. Yes, right? that's right. Yeah, it's, it's there for the story, though. It's not there for the action. Now, there are right. sequences. Yeah, there is actions. There are times where it gets your heart pumping. You're on the edge. You're you're fighting for your life. Absolutely. I love that, too. It's, it's Well, in the first beginning, right, when the beginning of the game starts up, I'm so tense, I'm sitting there, and my hands are they're like almost like clammy, right? <laughs> and my heart's just pumping. Dum, 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 and yeah. I'm just, I'm drawn in. I love the story. I can't get it up. Now, for the first season, you and I both played it on the Vita. Right. So, heading into the PS3 for season two, we lost our save files. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It's, uh, it's unfortunate. Um, what I'd like to have seen is the option of the first screen pops up saying, Did you play the game? For season one, and it say yes or no, and then from there have the option of did you take this person or that person? Right. Right. So if we take it into season three, hopefully there is an option of yeah. who you took with you and who you lost. Would yeah. have been nice. So that way it gives you more of a sense of where you're playing instead of coming in going, no, nah, you know, you're not really supposed to be alive right now. <laughs> that kind of feeling, right? Yeah. Now the worlds too. They've crafted the worlds incredibly well. What do you think of the environments and the disparity that we're seeing here? Yeah, the disparity and, you know, that whole living, no hydro, no water, you know, you really got to know what you're doing yeah. to survive out there. It's all about survival, yes. right? How do you survive? They've got reality shows where they toss people out and you watch them and see if they can survive. And this is kind of taking a, a taste of that, toss it into a video game and it gives you a sense of there is no living life here to choose from. The easy life is long gone. Absolutely. And, you know, again, you have these zombies that are coming out after you. So, you know, you're fighting them off. Then you're meeting people out in the world and you're literally almost fighting them off because you don't know if you can trust them or not trust them. It gets to be almost exhausting <laughs> in a sense, right? Yes. Because you're always on, on edge. edge. On guard. You're always on edge. Yeah. Now, the one thing I like with The Walking Dead is in the end, they bring up your stats. And now you can compare the choices that you've made and the choices that other people have made. It gives you a good feel of where you stood, right? Right. Did you, in the end, did you make the right decision compared to what everybody else feels? Exactly. Right? I, I was way off on a few. <laughs> <laughs> but I really like that. It gives you a good sense of feel as to where you stand 
Yeah, I like to be on the other side. I don't want to be with everybody else and either pick on the safe side or, you know what I mean? That kind of feeling of, this is my choice and that's where I stood. Right. It's a nice feeling to end each episode. Yes, exactly. Absolutely. All right, let's wrap up this episode. What are you going to give The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 1 by Telltale Games? I am going to give this a 7.5. We're going to go a little bit higher. I like where the story's going. I like now that Clem is starting to come, uh, come into her own character. I'm going to go with an 8.5. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hopefully you enjoyed this. Look for us on Twitter at 4 Next Level Gamers. Don't forget about our website, 4NextLevelGamers.com. And also hit us up as a like on Facebook. You can find me on all your consoles at Cutter28. And you can find me, Black Knight 6222. Until next time, we'll catch the next level. We're out.